In a move aimed at enhancing the capabilities of the Philippine Navy, the United States Department of Defense is increasing its efforts to modernize the nation's naval forces by facilitating the transfer of advanced unmanned technologies. Among the key assets being provided are unmanned surface vehicles, USVs, and unmanned aerial vehicles, UAVs, which are designed to significantly boost the Philippines' maritime surveillance, reconnaissance, and operational capabilities. A centerpiece of this growing cooperation is the deployment of advanced USVs, such as the Mantis T-12. This vehicle, developed by MARTAC, is a versatile platform measuring 3.6 meters in length, with a payload capacity of 64 kilograms. The Mantis T-12 is powered by a cutting-edge 6th generation electric engine, enabling it to reach speeds over 30 knots. It is capable of performing a wide array of missions, including surveillance, mine countermeasures, intelligence gathering, and swarm operations. The Mantis T-12 is also equipped with an impressive suite of sensors, such as electro-optical-slash-infrared, EO-slash-IR cameras, sonars, and lidars, which allow for detailed situational awareness. An optional gator configuration enhances its stealth capabilities by using a flooding hull, making it suitable for covert operations. This USV can be deployed from shore, ships, or even smaller vessels, offering considerable flexibility for the Philippine Navy. These unmanned surface vessels offer substantial strategic advantages. They not only increase the Navy's operational range and coverage but also provide real-time intelligence, surveillance, and reconnaissance ISR, crucial for the country's security. The Philippines' vast exclusive economic zone EZ demands constant monitoring for activities such as illegal fishing, smuggling, and potential security threats, and USVs are well suited to meet these needs. Alongside USVs, the U.S. is also providing the Philippine Navy with sophisticated UAVs, such as the Aerovel Flexrotor. Developed by Aerovel, a subsidiary of Airbus Helicopters, the Flexrotor is a small tactical unmanned aerial system, SDUAS, designed for surveillance and reconnaissance missions. This vertical takeoff and landing, VTOL UAV can be deployed from confined platforms like small patrol boats, adding to its versatility. With a wingspan of 3 meters and a length of 2.1 meters, the flex rotor is compact yet highly capable. It offers up to 33 hours of endurance, a top speed of 180 kilometers per hour, and a payload capacity of 8 kilograms. This UAV is equipped with an Alticum stabilized turret, capable of capturing high definition imagery day and night. Its ability to operate in GPS denied environments further enhances its operational capabilities, making it an essential asset for both military and civilian purposes. In addition to its primary ISR functions, the Flexrotor's autonomous operations and ability to transmit real-time video over distances of up to 120 kilometers make it ideal for a range of tasks, including environmental monitoring and data collection. Its compact design, ease of deployment, and fuel efficiency make it an optimal tool for the Philippine Navy, especially in remote or challenging maritime areas. In a related move, the Philippine Navy has issued a tender for VTOL-capable suicide drones, also known as loitering munitions. These systems are designed for precision strikes and can return to base for reuse if a mission is aborted, offering a high degree of flexibility and cost efficiency. This addition underscores the Navy's increasing reliance on unmanned systems to enhance operational capabilities while minimizing risk to personnel. The deployment of these advanced unmanned systems comes at a time when the Philippines faces significant maritime security challenges. As an archipelagic nation, the Philippines must constantly monitor its extensive EZ to safeguard its waters from illegal activities, including illegal fishing and smuggling. The introduction of USVs and UAVs enables the Philippine Navy to conduct continuous cost-effective surveillance with a much broader operational range than is possible with traditional manned assets. Moreover, these unmanned systems are not just military tools, they are also versatile in addressing humanitarian and environmental needs. In addition to their military applications, they are well suited for disaster response, search and rescue operations, and environmental monitoring, making them invaluable assets in both defense and civilian spheres. The Philippine Navy's increasing reliance on unmanned systems is also a response to the growing complexity of the regional security landscape. With the capability to operate in adverse weather conditions and in remote or high-risk areas, UAVs and USVs provide an unmatched level of operational flexibility. Their advanced ISR capabilities allow for more precise decision-making, enhancing the Philippine Navy's overall operational effectiveness and strategic positioning in the region. The transfer of advanced unmanned technologies, including USVs, UAVs and loitering munitions, 
is a crucial step in modernizing the Philippine Navy and ensuring its ability to address both national defense and maritime security challenges effectively. These systems will enhance the Navy's operational efficiency, provide broader coverage of the Philippines' maritime domain, and bolster its capacity to safeguard its waters and respond to diverse challenges. As part of the broader U.S.-Philippine defense cooperation, these unmanned technologies are set to play a key role in strengthening the Philippines' maritime defense infrastructure in the years to come.